Hello there people, this is Novo Mage and welcome for a really quick update. Well kinda as the title probably says <laughs> because yeah of course I'm just recording. But yeah as the title says uh well MAD number one tournament is going to be cancelled. And the reason why it's going to be cancelled is because well couldn't get enough players in time. Uh, I was hoping to get twelve players and in the end I kinda got like 9 uh, that were sure that we're gonna make it or pretty much like 10 more or less but the thing is that well I mean I, I could have I was thinking about doing it with even just 10 people because it's kinda possible you know, even if just by altering the rules a bit but the thing is that well it's not unusual that uh, the day of the tournament somebody just kinda make it or whatever happens so if there's one thing that I learned during during nothing is true number one uh, was that well uh, there were 16 people who were going to the tournament and I had like three or four people who were in the waiting list and in the end well one person the very same day just couldn't make it another person just couldn't connect had connection problems so yeah I mean like just going to, into the tournament with the exact amount of people didn't feel uh, very attractive for me in a sense but yeah anyway I guess uh, tournament didn't quite catch up as much attention as I was hoping it would but well yeah it, ha it has its issues especially since the base mode is assassinate so like some people just think like oh it's assassinate and yeah so that's in a sense why it maybe didn't catch up as I was hoping it would but oh well, uh, anyway that's as far as that goes. I was also going to talk a little about other things. Uh, pretty much my impressions of what's been going on uh, as far as Assassin's Creed 5 or Unity as it's called is going. Well the thing is that as you may know uh, Assassin's Creed Unity only has comparative multiplayer and since the moment that it was announced that there was not going to be competitive multiplayer, it was kind of like a shocker for most people. Although, in a sense, it was also, uh, I don't know, something that people had demanded before. Like, people were saying, like, oh, why do they release one AC multiplayer every year? They should take two years and blah, blah. But thing is that, uh, I mean, it, I think the most discomforting thing about the whole thing is that they haven't even said anything <laughs> well that was a huge mistake there playing <laughs> jumping into the table yeah but anyway as I was saying uh, uh, like they haven't even said anything about well maybe there's like small rumor here and there but there's no official news about there being um, an Assassin's Creed multiplayer in the future and what's worse about it is that currently I mean even the current multiplayer is kind of slowly dying, I could say. As I was saying in my previous video, like it's rare to, or it was, it was rare uh, a while ago. Recently, very, very recently, I have been actually managing to get uh, some decent competitive lobbies in PlayStation 4 and even in PlayStation 3, which is actually <laughs> uh, quite some news since I rarely even get a game there. But yeah, recently for some reason I just happened to be getting some good games and like the good players seem to be showing up. I'm not sure if it, if it all just had to do with the fact that Watch Dogs was released and that. I mean, I know that even for myself I was playing that game and... But yeah, I mean, I don't know if it was to the point where you wouldn't even find a game <laughs> on AC4. So yeah, it was kind of like that for a while. Uh, but recently I've actually been getting better luck. <laughs> I don't know if luck is the right term. Because, I mean, if if people are just not liking the game or if it's not as entertaining, uh, that's not the product of luck. It's just that people don't like the game anymore. But yeah, point is that uh, that's not quite happening as much anymore. So maybe, I mean, hopefully it's not just a burst. <laughs> Maybe, I mean, I hope that maybe it keeps going like that because 
if it doesn't keep going like that, that then I don't see how can I do like a nothing is true number two tournament. Although I mean you can see it both ways. Like if I did the nothing is true number two tournament, then that will kind of help as well uh, or uh, motivate people to get back into the mode or deathmatch that is in this case, uh, or at least on PS4. Obviously, this is a console-based thing. So it will only affect on PS4. I honestly haven't tried on on Xbox. I, I mean, I have my Xbox 360 and everything, but I haven't recently played much. Uh, haven't tried finding that much there. I maybe you know maybe there's a lot of people there. Not entirely sure about it. Uh, about it. But yeah, that's kind of how things are right now. Well, that's kind of all I had to say. Uh, for a change, yes, I did run out of things to say. <laughs> because I always say, no, I'm not going to finish it. But then I just make something up and that's about it. Well, this game, uh, I'm kind of going to let it here because I don't feel like just commentating what's going to be happening on screen. But this game is actually pretty interesting and I'm not going to spoil it for you. But yeah, this is one of those games... Uh, rare games <laughs> that I actually managed to get uh, with some good players in this case Scotty and Silver Scar Fox. So, yeah, I'll leave you to it. Um, yeah, it's three minutes, so yeah, I don't think I can just fill the gap there. So, yeah, I'll just leave you to it. And well, hope you enjoy, and I'll see you later. minute remaining. Get over here. <laughs> now. You have finished first. 